Well, the COVID crisis is getting worse in Alabama tonight. We're learning there are 11,000 new cases of the virus ripping through the state. So what is next for us? We brought that question straight to Governor Kay Ivey today, who was in town for a tourism conference. NBC 15's James Gordon joins us now live. James, she told you our current protocols are not changing. That's right. You know, even as hospitals across the state are overwhelmed, the governor says that we should all know what to do. In Gulf Shores today on the campaign trail and talking tourism, Governor Kay Ivey was surrounded by people wearing masks. She did not wear one. In Alabama at the moment, it is not required to wear a mask in a public setting. When does a governor perhaps uh, take into account that maybe masks or any other drastic ch changes have to be made? I mean, how do you assess that? I trust the people of Alabama. We know what to do. Take the vaccines, get the booster, and if you're in a crowded space inside and you need to wear the mask, uh, just use common sense and we'll be fine. A day after the state health officer said COVID is spreading like wildfire, the governor gave no indication that she is going to implement another stay at home order resulting from this most recent spike. And uh, the COVID numbers are excessively high, but y'all we've been at this, living with this stuff for three years. Alabamians know what to do. And so we just expect Alabamians to use good common sense and protect themselves and their families. Meantime, coming up at six, the reason why the governor was here today. We'll look at the reasons Alabama's tourism numbers saw a jump last year. Now we're live in Baldwin County, James Gordon, NBC 15 News.